So the next operation, Operation Strike from the Shadows, is dropping this Tuesday, and we have a lot of new content to talk about, brand new specialists, new game modes, new DLC weapons, and much, much more. So if you guys are excited for the new operation in Black Ops 4, definitely smash that like button, and let's jump right into it. Yo, what is going on YouTube? My name is Richard Right Away. Welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are all doing well. And guys, I am back from my trip. If you guys didn't know, I was actually gone for like the past like nine days. I was not here at my setup. All the videos you guys were watching of me were actually pre-recorded before I left for my trip. I actually went to London a little bit. I went to Italy and I also went to Greece. I posted a bunch of pictures and like stories on my Instagram. Uh, my Instagram is just right away. Link is down in the description or you can just look me up and find me there. But yeah, dude, I am back here. And do I look a little bit tan, guys? I actually look 10. I was out in the sun. I have a bright light in front of me, so it probably doesn't do it justice, but I, I am actually like sunburned right now. I have some color to me. It's crazy, dude. But either way, guys, while I was gone, Black Ops 4 and Treyarch, they actually started to release a lot of teasers and a lot of promotion uh, for the next operation starting in Black Ops 4 in just a couple of days. This upcoming Tuesday, guys, the 30th of this month, the new operation, Operation 4, is starting for Black Ops 4, and Treyarch, like I said, has started to release teasers hyping up this next operation and i wanted to go through all the teasers that they have released so far up to this point to get you guys up to date on what's going on to make sure you guys are caught up on everything black ops 4 news and info and what's happening for the next operation so hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video of course if you guys do definitely smash that like button man for the video grind to be back man and of course the new operation starting very very soon if you guys are excited man smash that like button subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new as well and with all that being said let's jump right into it so guys Actually, last Tuesday, I really thought we were going to be seeing a prop hunt and the new sniper rifle, the Mini-14 sniper rifle or the Vendetta sniper rifle that I've been talking about for like literally the past like month and a half. Like it's been crazy, man. I feel like I've been talking about this new sniper for so long and Treyarch just hasn't like come out with it. It's crazy. It was confirmed that prop hunt and the new sniper rifle were going to be coming for Operation Grand Heist, but they never actually released it. And Treyarch put out a tweet saying that prop hunt and the new sniper rifle are coming out in the next operation. So this new operation coming out on this Tuesday, the 30th, that's when we're going to be seeing the new sniper rifle and prop hunt. I don't know why they push back prop hunt and the new sniper rifle. The new sniper has been in zombies for a while. It's been in the files ever since Grand Heist uh, started basically. And it's so weird that they just never came out with the sniper rifle and they never came out with prop hunt. So we'll be seeing that game mode and the new sniper rifle in the next operation. Now last Tuesday, Treyarch came out with this statement right here and they said one week from today, Black Ops 4's fourth operation kicks into gear first on PlayStation 4, delivering new ways to play with a full season of fresh content coming to multiplayer, zombies, and Blackout. Watch for a detailed operation roadmap, reveal trailer, and Treyarch Studio live stream in the coming days as we prepare for the next evolution of Black Ops 4. So guys, we haven't had a roadmap revealed yet for this new operation. I'm sure that's going to be coming very, very soon, either maybe even tomorrow on Monday or like Tuesday when the operation drops. But like I said, we've been getting a ton of teasers, man, on Twitter from the Treyarch and the Call of Duty Twitters and whatnot, and I wanted to go through all of the teasers to get you guys up to date on what's happening for Call of Duty Black Ops 4. So on the screen right now, I will be showcasing the first teaser that we received for the new operation. The caption was armed and ready, and from this little teaser, it shows a person placing a C4 on the wall, just kind of ready to explode. But that's the first teaser we got. Nothing really too crazy showing a C4, though. We actually don't have a C4 in game, so I don't know if this is going to be like a new specialist ability. I don't know if it's going to be I don't even know, man, but it's kind of crazy that C4s might be returning. Now, the second teaser that we got was more of like a trailer, and this caption was Strike from the Shadows. So it shows a bunch of soldiers kind of walking out, and uh, this is like a new location or like maybe like a new map as well. I don't think we've seen this location before, so let me know in the comment section what you guys think. And as the trailer progresses, someone drops down from like the ceiling and throws a smoke grenade. And if you guys remember like a week ago, someone actually got a glitch in Black Ops 4 where it showed a smoke grenade referencing Spectre. So this definitely has to do a lot with the glitch that we saw. And now in this trailer, we see a smoke grenade. We see this mysterious man dropping from the ceiling. And uh, as the trailer progresses, you see him kind of whip out a katana 
slash sword and the mystery man starts taking down all of the soldiers and he's also basically invisible the soldiers cannot see him and they're just being all taken down with this katana with this sword and then at the end of the trailer he places a c4 on the wall so guys what does this have to do with anything man this is basically confirming that specter is returning yes guys specter is returning we all kind of figured specter was returning because of the glitch that we received last week uh, for black ops 4 someone in the community posted on reddit that they were just playing black ops 4 and uh, basically a smoke grenade text appeared as they were editing their class setup and it also referenced specter like we don't have a smoke grenade in the game specter is not a specialist in the game and we all kind of figured specter was going to be returning and from this trailer it shows that strike from the shadows is probably going to be the name of the new operation so hey i'm, I'm down with it strike from the shadows sounds really cool and it looks to be that specter is returning so let me know in the comment section what you guys think i thought it was a pretty cool trailer though now the third teaser that they released with it was kind of like a short teaser but it had a laptop on a table showcasing like new locations of either like a multiplayer map or a blackout map we really are not too sure what this could be and it also shows like blueprints on the table with a cup of coffee and we've actually seen this cup of coffee blueprint sort of image before and now it's returning so i don't know if these locations on the laptop are for multiplayer or blackout we're just gonna have to wait and see but just a short teaser for number three moving on to number four though Treyarch changed their profile picture on twitter and this is what they showcase it had like flames with a sword going through it obviously probably referencing specter once again maybe a sword like maybe new melee weapon i'm not too sure we always get a brand new melee weapon each operation for grand heist obviously we had the money bag the ka-ching and at this operation we definitely could see the katana return we actually did have a katana melee weapon in black ops 3 so i think the katana definitely has a good chance of returning uh into black ops 4 now the fifth teaser that they showcase and this was actually a huge one they showcase a remake of wmd from black ops 1 if you guys have ever played black ops 1 you should definitely recognize this map from the teaser that they showcase this is 100 percent confirming that wmd is coming back for black ops 4 now we don't know if it's going to be a brand new multiplayer map or it's going to be a brand new location for blackout but either way i think a lot of people were excited to see that wmd is coming back i absolutely love this map man i don't know how you guys feel about the map you guys can let me know in the comment section but black ops 1 was my first call of duty this is going to start bringing back a lot of memories and i feel like if this is for multiplayer because we did get news a little bit ago that Treyarch confirmed that we are getting three brand new multiplayer maps this upcoming operation strike from the shadows instead of the two multiplayer maps that we have been getting for each operation so we're getting three new multiplayer maps this time and wmd honestly could be one of the three maps that we're getting they could release maybe like two brand new maps and then also like the third one could be a remake which could be wmd so i'm really excited for wmd to come back man definitely has those black ops one vibes that i absolutely love so let me know in the comment section what you guys think now the six teaser guys they changed their profile picture once again on twitter and this was one of their most recent profile pictures and it showcases prop hunt basically it shows like the game mode emblem of prop hunt and uh, shows basically like a box with like some eyes peeking out of it so obviously someone is hiding and they're acting like a box obviously this is prop hunt guys we were supposed to see this game mode for operation grand heist and it never came out which was really really strange i'm actually happy it didn't actually come out last tuesday because i was away and if it came out last tuesday i wouldn't have been able to actually play it and get my hands on it so i'm assuming this upcoming tuesday with the release of the new operation strike from the shadows we should be getting prop hunt brand new game mode i mean we've kind of seen this game mode before in plenty of call of duties black ops 3 we also saw it in modern warfare remastered and i think we saw it for uh, world war 2 as well the prop hunt is definitely confirmed for this new operation coming up very very soon and then earlier today they posted a brand new teaser showcasing a new map and this was a really really scary sort of uh teaser i don't really know what's happening it kind of looks like a celebration maybe like a parade there's confetti there's all these like animal props and whatnot this is definitely a brand new either multiplayer map or blackout location i'm sure it's going to be a brand new multiplayer map though and it was a little bit scary man like it just showed these like animals all happy and smiling confetti it's like a parade in like a town or something like that we can't really you know decipher or get a good look of the map and whatnot from this teaser but it's just a short teaser that Treyarch posted today or call of duty posted today and i don't know let me know in the comment section if you guys can make out anything from this but it's a little bit scary but a new parade celebration confetti animal map coming i guess which uh, cool whatever i just hope it's a good map that's all i want so either way guys that is basically all the teasers and all of the information so far that we have for the upcoming operation starting this upcoming tuesday on the 30th and 
and uh, it's going to be called Strike from the Shadows, man. I'm sure it has to do a lot with Spectre returning because every single new operation, we get a brand new specialist. Uh, for Operation Absolute Zero, we got Zero. For Operation Grand Heist, we got Outrider. Now it's looking like we're going to be getting Spectre. He's going to have a katana. He's going to be invisible. C4s are possibly returning. We have WMD. We have some new map locations for Blackout. In the upcoming days, we should be getting a roadmap detailing every new piece of content coming. We're going to be getting new DLC weapons, new camos, new gear, new mastercrafts, reactive camos. It's going to be crazy, man. So if you guys are excited for the new operation, definitely click that subscribe button. Drop a like if you guys are excited. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you guys next time.